Hey there dessert lovers and fellow bakers, get ready to experience the magic of the irresistible espresso martini self-sourcing chocolate pudding. Before we dive into the sweet adventure, make sure you hit that subscribe button and show some love with the thumbs up if you're as excited as I am about this mouth-watering treat. Alright, let's get our hands deliciously dirty. In a large mixing bowl, we'll whisk together self-raising flour, sugar, cocoa powder, baking powder, and a pinch of salt. This is the foundation of this incredible pudding. And now in another bowl for the magic touch, an irresistible splash of espresso martini. Trust me, this is where the magic begins. You'll find a bowl of espresso martini online or in any good liquor store. Now add a whole egg, melted butter, a dash of vanilla extract, whisk together all this goodness. Okay, now let's combine the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients. Grease your baking dish. Now let's pour this wicked mixture into our baking dish. Oh, and make sure spread it out evenly for that perfect pudding. <laughs> I don't mind me, I just can't resist a little taste of this velvety smooth batter. Mm. It's incredible. Now brace yourselves because here comes the self-sourcing magic. In a bowl we'll mix together some brown sugar, cocoa powder and a hint of coffee for that deep incredible flavour. But wait, we're not done yet. We'll heat up some water until just bubbling or boiling and then carefully pour it over the pudding. I like to pour the boiled water over the back of a spoon. Just makes it spreading easier. All right, into the Dietrich she goes. Chef de Dietrich actually is what I call my oven at 180 degrees C. Well, that's 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And now we wait for about 35 minutes. The anticipation is always the hardest part, but trust me, it'll be worth every second. Our pudding has risen, and that divine sauce is peeking through and over the top there. I can hardly contain my excitement. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've been waiting for, our espresso martini self sauce and pudding is ready to steal the spotlight. I'll let it rest here for a little bit. Now, let's serve up the generous scoop of velvety vanilla ice cream or a dollop of cream. It's a dessert experience. I hope you enjoyed this irresistible journey with me. If you loved it, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and share the video with your fellow dessert enthusiasts. See you guys. Thanks for joining my sweet adventure today. Until we meet again, keep baking, keep savouring life's little indulgences, the magic is always in the pudding. <laughs>